My vision for Europe is very clearly the United States of Europe. We need a European, a European debate. They want to foster this debate with uh, 25 heads to be uh, shown on the, on the European uh, political scene. That is normally it's a good idea, but I don't see the debate yet. Be um, the politicians here, the deputies, they have voted for this, but they do not campaign for this. And uh, there is no clear, uh, what is the parliament standing for, apart from the, from the daily business? Can you mention three topics the parliament wants, three demands, the th three requests they really ask from the, uh, from the council or from the people to have for their rights or for their uh, political standing? There's, there's no debate for the moment. We, have, uh, we are very proud of it that we have so many languages and cultures in Europe, but that is also a problem for public debate. In the 19th century, theorists said no democracy if there is not one language. And we have no such language. Even English doesn't work. As a, um, it's work it's, it works as a working language, but it's not working as a language for public European opinion, because uh, only a small elite, who is more global even than European, is reading everything in English, but in France, in Italy, in Germany, especially in the very big countries, in Spain, nobody is uh, da reading daily or weekly an English uh, newspaper or magazine. And uh, that's the point uh, which is very important. And uh, I, had a, I started a project on this. Uh, uh, I would like to found a European uh, monthly magazine in three languages. All articles together in three languages, German, English and French. But I wasn't able in 2009 to find the million uh, euros to start it. <laughs> the publishing houses uh, are too conservative for this.